It has been an honor and a privilege to work side by side with you to strengthen our democracy. And with that, I just have two more words to say. Obama out. Hi, I'm Sally and welcome to Reality Bites, where we give you a bite-sized chunk of what you missed. While most people are focused on the presidential race, the actual president did something funny. So we're going to focus on that. Barack Obama had his last White House Correspondents' Dinner, although his speech sounded more like a roast as he entered the I don't give a shit mode in his last few months in the White House. He threw by throwing zingers at Donald Trump, Hillary Clinton, Ted Cruz and the media, making the most of the security he still has. There's been discussion of providing maternity leave to women who don't take maternity leave because they're the ones picking up the slack while others go to raise their child. So you're telling me that I got pregnant for no reason? Ex-Twitter product head Michael Sippy has unveiled his new app called Talk Show, where anyone can see your text conversations and ask to join. Now I can see what my boyfriend and Felicia are always talking about. Bye Felicia. 20 years after the Port Arthur massacre, Australian data shows that the chances of being killed by a gun has been reduced by 72%. Who would have thought? Less guns, less people dying of guns, duh. In other news, water is wet. A teacher in Tennessee has been suspended after showing his class horror movie Human Centipede 2. But hey, that's one way you can learn about the digestive system, am I right? Senior police are supporting a nationwide pill testing trial at Australian music festivals this summer. In a totally unrelated note, does anyone want to buy my field day ticket? A bag of air from NBA star Kobe Bryant's final game has reached a bid of over $15,000 on eBay before the site removed the item. $15,000? There is no need for a punchline here. $15,000. The Productivity Commission has handed down a draft report recommending we get rid of geo-blocking. I guess I still have a few episodes of Breaking Bad left to watch. Apple announced its first decline in revenue since 2003. The tech giant only made $10 billion in profit this year. Rumours are that CEO Tim Cook is about to start a crowdfunder. Australia is still the top country, not in education, not in employment and not in medical care, but in pirating Game of Thrones. Oh, and obesity. So that's all the stuff that you probably didn't need to know, but we told you anyway. We'll see you next week for more Reality Bites.